Hi there, we have an exciting trip for you today, and look, we're, we're back. doing another video. See, we told you the truth. Um, before we got started today, we just want to talk a little bit about how overwhelmed we were with all the comments and good wishes from everybody who watched our video we just posted about coming back, and it was pretty amazing. We haven't responded to any comments because it was overwhelming, but we've read every single one of them, and we really appreciate all of the kind words from all of you out there. Yes, and really, uh, some of them were just so touching. It felt like you were sitting with us in our kitchen just sharing with us, and we really appreciate it. So thank you so much for all of that support. All right, let's get going today. Good morning. Welcome back to the Tomarosa. Getting ready to get in the truck and go to Spokane. Uh, we bought a trailer, and we have to go pick it up. So why don't you come along? hooked up to the trailer pull it out check it out and then we also have a dolly to pick up all right and you may be thinking what are we doing why do we why do we need a trailer so um as part of uh the creamery they're looking for some extra storage and so we got a good deal on just a used trailer as you can see there's a bunch of them because yellow trailer uh they went out of business and so there was a huge auction and we're like, well, you know, we'll do it. And then we can just let the creamery use it as an interim storage solution for glass bottles. And so that's why we're here <laughs> picking up a used trailer. But the truck rode well, riding bobtails a little jerky. So on the way back with the weight, it will be nicer. And Stacy's just getting everything set up so we can go.
is this for? This is a converter dolly, so it's used for hooking two trailers together. And the reason I bought this is uh, future proofing uh, the milk hauling. So we got the new milk tanker coming and it will be set up with a pendle hook on the back. So in the future, if I ever wanted to, I could put the old tanker on the dolly and be able to pull two tankers. It's ours now, so time to go home. At least we're not bobtail, so the ride home should be a little smoother. I don't remember what I mentioned before. Uh, a long time ago, we did do a video about the milk tanker, but I figured I'd start again. So behind me is our milk hauling setup right now. So it's the International Tractor and 1961 Heil milk tanker. It's 2,500 gallon, and you can't see it on this angle, but on the other side, there's a pump box for pumping on at the farm. It was originally purchased new by the Carnation Company and I bought it uh, from another milk hauler over on the coast and it took a lot of work to get it usable. So it's been serving us well, but I'm excited about our new tanker coming soon. Well, here it is. It's back at the farm. We got to do some work to it a little bit. Uh, mostly just making it look pretty uh, before we use it as a storage trailer for the creamery. Uh, but it's good to have it on the farm. Looking forward to getting it prettied up a bit. Uh, mechanically, it looks like it's in great shape. So it's actually one of the newest pieces of trucking equipment we have, but uh, yeah, looking forward to fixing it up and uh, put it to work. So thanks for coming along with us as we went trucking today and we'll see you next time on the Tomarosa.